How's the body holding up and kind of what happened with the injury, if you could tell us? Uh, I don't want to get too deep into that. I just know that I'm getting better and um, looking forward to uh, being available this week. How hard is it to be out when you, they do have so many guys out the, on, on defense starters right now? Um, it, it's tough. I know it's, it's very tough mentally as well. Um, you don't want to be that guy. Uh, and you're always trying to help um, just whatever your role is on this team. Um, but it, it, it is a great feeling now that um, I'm out there and able to compete with the guys. What is the challenge when you have a guy like Cam Jordan, Marcus May, Marshall Nottomar, a couple of household names that have been out and asking guys to step up? Um, I, I wouldn't say it's too tough when we know that we got guys that can go in there and, and do it. Um, I think we pride ourselves on um, the next man up. Mm -hmm. And we got a lot of good players that, that are able to do that, um, taking pride in our coaching and, and just going out and flying around having fun out there. So I think as long as we keep that mindset, obviously we want some of our star players out yeah. there, but, uh, but we got guys that can go there and make a difference. Does it help having already faced the Carolina Panthers once this season, getting them again? Um, yeah, I mean, it's always great having repetition against a team um, that you're going out against a second time, um, seeing Bryce Young again, knowing that we played them, played him a first time, what he was able to do well against us, um, trying to eliminate those things and also getting more games on film to watch him mm -hmm. um, is better. So obviously with a young quarterback like that, it's you need a lot to watch. Um, so playing him earlier in the season, it was kind of tough. We didn't really know what to expect, but um, we should have a better grasp of it this time. You still had a lot of success against the Panthers, especially you know defensively mm -hmm. holding them in that second game of the season. Yeah, how can you get back to some of the things that you guys did well there? I mean, the team had four sacks in that game. Mm -hmm. um, I think it it starts with our ability to get pressure on them. Um, they're they are a team that's taking a lot of sacks, and uh, I think um, being able to get pressure on him, even with rushes that we're not really bringing a, bringing as much people, I think is going to be huge. Um, just taking advantage, taking advantage of that. Um, but he uses his feet so well, so he can make things happen. So we also got to be smart. Um, so it starts with the rush, and then rush, then go on to the linebackers and coverage, and then obviously holding it down in the secondary. So we all work together, rushing and coverage. So um, if we can cover up well, then um, then somebody's got to get there to bring him down. Starting fast has been something that's been talked about a lot from the defensive side. Mm -hmm. Not the case last week, but knowing right. that you did have success against against the Panthers, you know how much confidence does that give you guys that you can get out and have a good start? Yeah, I, I think that we have to go back to the the defense that we were the first uh, five weeks of the season, um, starting out fast and and uh, really making an impact and uh, helping out our offense. I think the, the biggest key to victory this week is our ability to um, keep good field position. And I think as long as we have great field position, we're putting them in tough spots to start and putting our offense in great uh, positions. I think that'll be the key there. Uh, but just executing, playing with each other, playing complementary defense is what we need to get back to.